Hey everyone, this is Nitro. Continuing on with the Valorous Rhapsody event, it's time to do the fifth battle, Ultimate Fighting Forum. Although we have come this far in the contest, I still have some concerns. What the heck is this? I'm no good at these kind of dice rolling games. Looks like the, this dice is the key to everything. The result of the dice determines the theme of our next challenge. That last challenge was definitely because Mac influenced the dice roll, which ended up pitting us against such tough opponents. Tiffany, I think you should try it this time. Maybe beginner's luck will get us through this. Okay. No, no, no. Miss Rachel, you're the protagonist. I think you should go. Then Licorice, do you want to try? To be honest, not really. After all, Velzeria has a saying, demons don't throw dice. Meow, I'm dozing off. It feels like our four contestants have been standing around for half a day already. Have you still not decided who's gonna throw the dice? Since the result of the dice roll will affect the course of the contest, what's the problem of us being a little cautious? You're too indecisive. Anyway, you'll have to experience all the challenges in the end regardless. In a sense, no matter what we roll, the result will be the same, right? The designers made it specially like this for a theatrical effect. This is an important anniversary event after all. It needs to be exciting! Besides, the stage designers painstakingly created all these different challenges. If they were not at all experienced at some point or another, wouldn't it be a waste meow? Well, you have a point. Emily, what are you doing? Hmm? What does this question mark mean? Emily, when did you roll the dice? Meow, the Knight of Mystery takes charge as always. Congratulations, this time you will enter the Chaos Challenge. Chaos? What is that? In other words, you'll enter a random dimension and be plunged in a new environment unknown to all, meow. It's a totally unique experience. Like a gachapon machine. Are our contestants excited and looking forward to it? To be honest, I just feel more worried than anything. Meow, right, since when... Since where you end up this time depends entirely on your luck. Out of consideration for system security, I won't be able to come with you. Eh? What? Well then, good luck, meow! That black cat. He disappeared just like that. Whoa! What? What is this warm aura? Where are we? Ah, I see Ares. My brother is over there. And I see Landius. Strange. How is it they're here in the Rose Division contest? Ah, uh, guys, look! Brother's popularity is so high! We're siblings too, so why is Brother's popularity so much higher than mine and Ricky's? Yeah, Licorice is thinking the same thing. Ares is a popularity champion. Let me go ask him what this is all about. I don't know what's going on, but based on the current situation, I think we should go and meet with them first. Three, two, one, let the match begin. Whoa, is that really the man of legends standing right there in front of everyone? That's Leon for you. Just from hearing the resounding cheers of the audience, you can tell how high his popularity is. Seems so. Mr. Bozo, do you smell something sour? <laughs> Didn't I tell you I've already retired? Why am I being dragged along as a guest commenter for a boring contest like this? It seems this world still can't be deprived of a great character like the Dark Prince. <laughs> hey, Bozo, it's really interesting to see you get so excited about your dark cycle of retirement and reemployment. So, how about it? Don't you plan on going in there to test your mettle? The honor of kings is proven through the contest of blood and strength. Hush, how could the dignified Dark Prince go and compete on the same stage as those dirty scoundrels? It's an insult to everything I stand for! Even having retired, you still care so much about this Dark Prince identity. Alright, alright. As special guests of the Popularity Revival Contest Supreme Division, we can't squabble while sitting here in the host seats. 
By the way, Wowler, seems like you weren't popular at all this time last year. Yet this year you're in the top four? <laughs> Perhaps I have some kind of unique and mysterious charm, no? Ha. Huh. As far as I can tell, the only reason you're so popular is because of your powerful three-cost skill. <laughs> It's so true. <laughs> oh my god. After all, nowadays in Apex Arena, you can't just rely on Sword Dance, Rupture, and Bloodthirsty to win. <laughs> That's why Bernhardt isn't in anyone's box right now. Though, how come you're how come you've become a guest host instead of a participant in the contest? Don't tell me that reaching the top four is enough for you. Uh Fighting and killing really isn't my strong point. Not to mention, the one you'll have to challenge in the end is this year's champion, Ares. Ares? Who's that? What does that guy even do? Does anyone even know? Nope. Although I'm not sure about the details, I hear that he's a new star of Apex Arena, the kind that can bypass tanks and strength from 10 blocks away. Yeesh, you're giving me goosebumps. Good thing I already retired. <laughs> Oh, are those three sexy beauties in swimsuits over there and the cute little girl here to watch the match? What? We've been spotted. Coming here dressed like that is conspicuous to say the least. Did you expect me not to notice you? Is this the latest cheerleader skin? So hot. <laughs> no, we're actually just here to participate in the popularity contest. Now that you mention it, you do seem to have popularity numbers above your heads that are exclusive to contestants. Licorice, your popularity is so high! Uh, Master Fossil, you're here too. <laughs> good! Very good! My successor has not brought shame upon me! Hmm. And what are you allies of justice doing alongside Licorice? Do you have some ulterior motive? Actually, Master Bozo, we've come here to looking for someone. I'm looking for Brother Ares. Ares? Are you here to challenge the popularity champion too? In that case, this changes everything. The contestants of the Rose Division challenging the popularity champion of the Supreme Division. Is there a more audacious show of strength? Indeed it is! Hey, Leon, did you hear that? These ladies want to challenge Ares! In what sort of way? Wink wink, nudge nudge. I understand. They've certainly got spirit. But first, please test your medal against us. We won't go easy on you just because you're girls. Well then, prepare. Well then, please try your best. Wait, we're not... The players have only ever liked the strongest characters. Come, defeat us and prove your strength. Ready. We are not here to stick a challenge. What do we do? They're not listening to us at all. It seems to be this stage's trial. Since we can't escape, we'll have to face the challenge. But they seem really strong, and we don't have max support this time. In any case, we've got a personal stake in this contest now. We must strive for the highest ranking. Hmm. Alright, so... We might as well start with debuffing. Right? Let's see what she applies. Magic damage reduction cannot receive buffs. Okay. And... Why don't I just... Let's see. Sword Soul Defense Break Roar. Well, I can't have everyone swarm in, so maybe I'm just going to launch out Arcane Blast. Have... Hmm? 
Knight of Mysteries, Broken Spear. Yay, got a stun. And range attack. Well, getting the stun should make this super easy then. Sword Soul. Liffany takes a crap ton of damage. And she's alive. Which is the most important part. Cannot be dispelled. So... If I want to keep her alive, I probably have to move her behind the others. So something like this. One last range attack. There we go. Lifting uh, Leon down. Are we really going to give up here? And now Ellen. Wow, so strong. They sure are heavyweights of popularity. Seems that here in the Supreme Division, popularity is entirely a manifestation of strength. If we don't do something soon, not only will we be unable to find brother, we might even be expelled from the contest grounds for failing the challenge. Damn it, we can't fall here. I don't particularly like this whole setup much, but with things as they are now, this is the only way. Brother! Brother Landius, where are you? <laughs> hey, Landius! Don't tell me you're putting girls before bros. I can't help it. My little sister is calling for help. My big sister is over there too. If I refuse them, I will... <laughs> I'll never hear the end of it. <laughs> you deserve it, both of you. Fair enough. Alright. So even if you don't get the stun the way I did, this should be pretty clearable. Especially with Landius here to guard. So, um, might as well. Just cast Mass Heal with Icarus. That's her whole role in the first place, after all. Have Lando attack. And the others will range attack. So now that Landis is here, it's gonna be an easy fight. Could really be auto battled at this point. But there we go. If I hadn't used so much energy before, damn it. Landis, you're like her own private summonable pet. <laughs> Actually, it's true that I always call brother for help whenever I run into danger. Even though I've always gotten mocked for it, it's the only thing I can resort to in such situations. <laughs> you're my little sister. If you're in danger, no matter what, I'll always come to save you. Having said that, what are you doing here, sis? And in a swimsuit? Ah, have you come to cheer me on? I'm so touched! Honestly, guys, the contest isn't even over yet, and you've already started with the banter? Say, you found a strong helping hand in Landius. Fine with me. I always wanted to face off against the popularity heavyweights for quite some time. Let us see who is the strongest in a fair fight. Wait a second, you'll have to face me too! It's Ares! Oh, the champion joins the fray? In that case, let's settle the score today. Okay, so after I beat one, another shows up. Now the question is, can I kill Sigma? In time. Let's see. It's certainly worth the try. I think the answer is no. 
Or yes, if he attacks me by himself like that. And let in decide to judgment instead of divine guard. So everything is kind of going my way to make it easier to clear. Of course, if it didn't, I would probably noble charge let in to remove his divine guard or whatever. But um, in this case, I'll just finish off Sigma like this. Damn it. So I'm still not strong enough? If extra action didn't consume my fusion power buff. It's okay, brother. We can still count on the hero evolution plan. <laughs> SP class will keep you alive. You cannot go wrong with the SP class. Alright, let's just keep healing up everybody. Oops. I just missed Rachel. Not that she needs it. So... Let's just finish off Ledin and be done with all of this. Interesting. So now he's never going to activate the Vanguard because his... The only character he would guard is dead. That's actually really convenient. And a missile air slash? There we go. Wait a second, Ledin. What's the deal with the hero evolution plan? Are even the powerful contestants of the Supreme Division forced to leave the field so quickly if they fail the challenge? How cruel. Now is not the time to lament over the contest rules. If it were not for the timely arrival of Brother Landis and Ares, we would have been the ones forced to leave the field. Right, 30 Trinity Crystals. Chris, aren't you contestants of the Rose Division? What are you doing in the Supreme Division com competition grounds? Everyone here is ready for a fierce battle. Actually, we were teleported here by chance, but I didn't expect to run into you, Ares. This is great. Ares, if it's okay, will you protect us? That way, we might have a chance of winning the championship. Ah, uh, um, but Brother has already promised Maya, Renetta, Rosalia, and Florentia. <laughs> Harem bastard. <laughs> One, two, three, four, so many girls? Wow, it seems this Ares guy really is a big shot. Oh, I see. Licorice was too late. Um, but I'm sure Landius can manage it. Landius, hmm? Where is he? I haven't seen him since the end of the contest. Speaking of which, have you guys seen Rachel? Nope. Huh, I hear a quarrel going on outside. Sounds like Rachel and Landius. Yeah, I thought they were on good terms. Let's go see. Alright, another day, another battle complete. The prologue was pretty amusing, especially with Wilder and Bernhard. Let's see what the next battle will be tomorrow, which is called the Popular Heroine Script Discussion. But that is it for now. Thanks for watching everyone, Nitro out.